first movement here is going to be the sidescape, a simple sidescape. The, the most important thing on the sidescapes, my head and my shoulders raised higher to, from the ground. My legs are good flat on the ground. Now I'm going to turn around to my side and move my hip for the opposite direction. Come back for the original position. The same thing for the other side. I can do the same movement, alternate legs. Okay? Now, I'm going to do the opposite of side skate. Instead of going side skate in that direction, I'm going to go the side skate for that direction. I'm going to use the alternate legs and move this way. The reason I like that because a part, uh, I find it from my opening, if he is on the south-north position, I need to set up a space. I want to learn how to move in that direction. In case he is in that direction, I need to move that direction. I use the side scape in that direction. In case he over here, I can use the same movement to open a gap for set up the escapes. Okay. The next movement I like to show you, who is very important, here is the bridge. Okay, the bridge here is going to be flat the feet on the ground, raise the hip. When they raise the hip here, I'm going to turn my head and go all my weights between my shoulder and my elbow. I flat here, my elbow. I want to put all my weight here. When I have my weight here and turn my head, I can do movements with my feet. Here I can swing the leg over, come quick on my knees. Okay, on the other side. Okay, raise, elbow on the ground, put the weight right here, head over here, movements, can swing the leg here. Okay. The other movement important, when my arm is straight, yeah, I can't do the bridge. I'm going to move here, put my body in a side position, you're going to switch the leg, going to my knees. Over here, I slide from there, come to my knees. One more time. My arm is more straight here. I'm not able to do the bridge much. What happens, I get to the side. You see in this position, I raise this leg from the ground for giving me a good chance to rotate my hip. In case I only use this leg here, I'm not going to be able to rotate my hip, but I use the leg on the air. Look at the difference. How easy I'm going to be able to turn my hip in here, bring the elbows back, or go for the guy and get a strong position to fight for the sweep or for the reverse. Okay? Okay. Let's do a quick review about all, all the movements here. First one, a simple side scape. Okay? Now, I'm going to do by alternate the legs. Okay? One more time, moving. You see how important is the head higher from the floor. The head low, the head stuck me on the ground. I haven't, most of the times, escapes. It's very important, the head and the shoulders be higher from the ground for give a chance for you go for your side, it's very easy. Okay, now let's do the alternate of side escape. Okay, come back like that. Now do the bridge. Remember the elbow and the shoulder. Not only the shoulder, elbow and shoulder. You can move, swing. Okay, you can rotate for the other side. Very good. Next one, I'm straight. 
come over here. The other side, nice straight.